My videos are partially sponsored by USAMiniMotors.com. Click the link in the description. What is happening, fellow pioneers of human transportation? I'm Yogi Steve. This is ESA, the Electric Scooter Academy. Videos about high-powered scooters. Now I'm gonna show you all my safety gear. I get tons and tons of questions about my gear. The long and short of safety gear is don't buy cheap stuff. I went through so much cheap safety gear, I spent probably twice what it cost on all this more expensive gear, going through cheap shit, breaking it, or realizing that you can't wash it and stuff like that. You wanna buy washable, high quality safety gear, you're gonna spend a few hundred bucks on your gear at least. The exception to this whole kit is my helmet. My helmet I know is a piece of crap. Everybody wants to know about my gloves. C-T-H-O-P-E-R. These are like fingerless gloves, and what I like about them is the palm is super, super hard. Not only good for falling, and I'll tell you, the scratches you see embedded on here are from real falls. These gloves have saved my ass. They don't protect your fingers, but I need my fingers loose for the job and to use my phone. Now, when it comes to my shins and my elbows and my knees, I have Liat elbow and knee pads, and I really like these. And I did take, these are banged up because I lean on them a lot, but I did take a real legitimate fall on these not too long ago, and they absolutely saved my knees because I have put gravel into my knees in my history of riding scooters. So I like these elbow pads, but to be honest with you, they're, I'd actually like them to be a little more burly. I felt like these knee and shin pads were such monsters that I thought when I ordered these that they would be similar, but I want something even more heavy duty than this. And they don't really fit, it's embarrassing. My skinny ass arms, I gotta put a bandana in there to make it fit tightly. So those are my shin pads, my knee pads. Look, now listen, these are just cheap three quarter face $40 helmets I get off of Amazon. I don't really recommend them. They're better than a bicycle helmet, but they're not super high end helmets. And I do plan on upgrading this. I'm gonna spend two or 300 bucks on my next helmet and get something better. But as far as safety gear goes, that's pretty much it. Elbow pads, knee pads, shin pads, gloves, and helmet. And I'll tell you, in order of what's important, helmet, gloves, knees, elbows. Always helmet, always gloves. Knees and elbows may be optional. And now I'm gonna put all this gear on, I'll show it to you. When you put your elbow pads on, okay? You want to make sure your elbow is covered because when you fall, you fall like this. You hit the ground and then your elbow goes down. You want to make sure el el elbow is covered. So what I really like about these is a strap above my calf, a strap below the calf that really keeps it secure. I like these gloves. Helmet's pretty easy. Boom. All right, guys, you can see putting your gear on and taking it off, it's a pain in the ass, but you gotta do it. You gotta wear all your gear. I'm Yogi Steve. This is ESA, the Electric Scooter Academy. Videos about high-powered scooters. I appreciate you watching my videos. I really appreciate your support. Let me ask you to subscribe to the channel. Like the video if you liked it. This is an interactive channel. Leave a comment down below. Ask me questions and I'll always talk back to you. Thanks guys, appreciate your support. Let's go on this group ride now. Be the hero of your own movie. If your life was a movie and it started now, what would the hero of your life's movie do right now?